Look, I'm, I'm not a market timer. I'm a value investor, and most people should be value investors, frankly. And so I look at long term. Look at the long term. The number one catalyst that nobody's going to talk about, especially your show and others like this, is the number one catalyst is the corporate tax. This is the market mover. If you're I was right. a CEO, Brad, 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 hold on a second, Brad. It, it, Brad, hold on, hold on. Yes. You, you're, you're talking to do financial journalists, right? Uh, I, I don't know if my, I didn't know you were going to bring this up, so I don't have the chart ready, but we always put it on. I can find it and I can tweet it out to you. This market started going up on March 9th, 2009, and if you have a ruler, it's a pretty much straight line from there to now. So there is nothing Donald Trump has done to cause the market to be where it is right And now. President Trump would like tax reform to get it done, but those who are working on it have said the president is doing nothing to advance that agenda. And look at those CEOs that are on that council but who I walked just, away from Stephanie, him. I want him to answer my question. Because you guys keep peddling this myth that Donald Trump is responsible for this market. You, you are a market guy. You have seen the S&P 500 since March 9th, 2009, right? Absolutely. So do you give Barack Absolutely. Obama and, and look, credit look, look, for look. all of the stuff that happened from March 9, 2009 to January 20th, 2017? The number one driver of this Just answer stock the question, market. Brad. Answer the question, Brad. And what is the question? You, do, do you give Barack Obama the credit for all the stuff that happened from March 9, 2009 to January 20th, 2017? Because if you do that, He's not. then you realize it's not Donald Trump. But the, right now, the commander in chief is Donald J. Trump. And in terms of the market mover, what's going to actually move this market? And what we're seeing now is job creation. President Trump has created over a million jobs. Oh, my Brad, goodness. Brad, Brad, Brad stop Brad. it. For heaven's sake, you know that in the last six months of 2016, there were more jobs created. In the first six months of 2016, in the last six months of 2015, first six months of 2015, last six months of 2000. I mean, I can just keep on going. Donald Trump's not even close to being the largest job creator in the first six months of his presidency. There are four recent presidents who do better than him. Why do you continue to say these things? Brad, yesterday, Steve Schwartz.